Recover Out Loud. It's a concept we told you about one year ago today. And since then, the addiction recovery program started in Greensburg has expanded to several more cities. RTV 6's Stephanie Wade is in Columbus, showing how speaking up is helping hundreds of Hoosiers every day. When you come in here and you start to open up, you start building that confidence and that self-belief in yourself, especially when you put yourself out there live on Facebook. A controversial concept, drug and alcohol addicts talking about their addiction live on Facebook for the world to see. Welcome to Recover Out Loud. As addicts, you think everybody's against you. And what we're finding is that's not true. Everybody's actually for us. And when somebody sees somebody they used to know as an addict coming out and being that kind of brave and that courageous and put their story out there and they're being embraced, they're like, oh my gosh, like people do care. The group is called Recover Out Loud. We first told you about them one year ago today. Now they're helping hundreds of Hoosiers each week. Since February of last year, Recover Out Loud has expanded to five counties and received two proclamations from mayors of both Greensburg and Columbus. It's put so much life into my life. I have a good career. I have a good home. My girls are happy. I'm happy. Raised by addicted parents on the east side of Indianapolis and struggling with it herself since she was a teenager. My high school sweetheart died from an overdose when I was 18 years old. And from that point on, um, I went through a deep depression and got into pills myself for the next year. Megan Cothran started coming to Recover Out Loud meetings and says she's been healing ever since. Recovery for me is a lot of self-love and when you love yourself, you don't put those things in your body and you don't allow those toxic relationships into your life. It breaks that shame, you know, it, shame can only thrive in secrecy. You know, when you, when you speak on it, you get loud about it, it just begins to lose its power. And at that point, I think things start to shift. Breaking the silence. I needed someone to say, you do have a voice, you do have a platform, and you do deserve recovery. And empowering people to make a change. Working for you, Stephanie Wade, RTV6. Well, the group has weekly meetings in Greensburg, Columbus, Shelbyville, Jess Jeffersonville, excuse me, and Fort Wayne. We will attach their Facebook page and YouTube channel on our website at theindiechannel.com.